What up, what up? Wimbush here, and I just wanted to give you this quick tip, something that always gets me every time if I'm working in different frame rates. Now, by default, Cinema 4D, if you come into your render settings output, it always defaults at 30 frames per second. So say that you wanna work in a project that's 24 or even 60 frames per second, you'll think, okay, let me go to render settings, set this to 60, and I'll be good. But that's actually not the case and I make this mistakes numerous times you know you set your frame rate to 60 thinking that you're rendering out at 60 and then whenever you import your project the uh, uh, frames are just kind of all discombobulated and that's because you have to actually change it in two places now if you look down here my timeline is 90 frames so let's go up to edit come down to project settings and you'll see over here under FPS it's still set to 30 and even though my render settings are set to 60 here, my project settings are set to 30. So what I'll do, you'll see the timeline down here change as well. I set my project settings to 60 and you see the jump down here in my timeline, it went from 90 and doubled to 180. So now my project is at 60 frames and I'm also gonna render at 60 frames. So I just wanted to share that with you guys because I know it gets me every time I forget to switch it in both places. So I'm sure it's happening to other people out there as well. And so, you know, just wanted to give you guys that quick tip. And so as always, check back to the channel and keep creating. Thank you guys again. I'll see you next time.